For those who are going in order, this is my images and radio buttons quiz that I gave my students. If you run it, you can see that we have different pictures that can be selected with these radio buttons. And then I asked my students to add a few regular buttons that would also scroll through the pictures. And as they did, the radio buttons on the right would change. And when it got to the bottom, it would loop back to the top. And if we got to the top, it would loop back to the bottom. So here's how we did that. Double click on the button. We scroll up to the very top, right under the public class form one. You see we're in the declaration section. I created a global constant called image number or image num. I saved it as an integer and it's going to keep track of what image I'm at. Then in the form load, I set image number equal to 13, the first picture I wanted to display. That was the default picture. And then, just to show you that if you click on the next button, this is the code you get. The first thing you'd like to do is increase image number by one. I'm going to leave this line to be discussed in just a moment. And then I used a select case to act on that image number. So if the image number is 13, I put 13 in the image box, and then I also make the radio button number 13 checked equal to true. I do that for 14 and so on. Now when you get down to, to case 18, the next time you click the number, image number would be 18 plus 1 or 19. Well, we don't have 19 images. So I've made this little if-then statement. If image number is greater than 18, then set image number equal to 13. So this is the next button. The same code can be run for the previous button. Again, we increment our image number, but this time we have to subtract one. So if the image is less than 13, we want to loop over to make the image 18. You could use an if-then block instead of the select case. for example. If the image number is 13, then so and so, so and so. And that's basically it. So I hope that you solved it the same way or close to the same way. Thanks for watching.